Hi, my name is Jason Harlow. Welcome to my V Office Hour. I'm going to go over uh, Physics 132 H1F Fall 2010 Test 1 Problem 6 from Version 1. This is based on Night Second Edition Chapter 23 and 24. There's uh, some material from the Thin Lens Equation uh, from Chapter 23 of Image Formation in a Camera. Also this problem lists F number, which is a concept from the chapter 24 on optical instruments. So first, let's carefully read the problem. The lens in your digital camera has a diameter of 2.5 millimeters, and according to the manufacturer's specification, its F number is F 4.0. The lens is held a certain distance away from the detector in order pr to produce a well-focused picture of a flower that is 15 centimeters away. I'm assuming that means 15 centimeters away from the lens. You then turn to take a picture of a distant landscape. How far must the lens be moved and in, what, in which direction in order to obtain a well-focused picture of the landscape? A is 0.71 meter, millimeters closer to the t detector, uh, and two more, B and C, are also closer to the, to the detector, and D and E are further from the detector. Okay, so from chapter 23, we have the thin lens equation, which comes up a lot. It's uh, the 1 over S plus the 1 over S prime equals 1 over F, which is the focal length. But this problem doesn't actually give the focal length it gives this F number, F 4.0, and that's a little different. And it's a dimensionless number, and it comes from chapter 24. And the F number is the ratio of the focal length F divided by the diameter of the lens. So let's take a look at my solutions. So first of all, I draw the diagram for the thin lens equation. Uh, when considering the flower. So S is the object distance between the flower and the lens, which uh, I believe is 15 centimeters in this problem, and S prime is the image distance from the lens uh, to the detector. So if the image is formed on the detector, you get a well-focused image. Now there's that equation for F number, F over D is equal to 4.0, Solving for f, we get f is 1.0 uh, centimeters, 10 or 10 millimeters. So solving the thin lens equation for the image distance is s prime equals the inverse of 1 over uh, focal length minus 1 over object distance. Plugging in the numbers there, I get s prime equals, uh, in centimeters, 1.0714. Now that's when you're focusing on the flower, the proper distance of the lens from the detector is 1.0714 centimeters. Now let's look at the uh, landscape. In the case of the landscape, the object distance approaches infinity. And what that means is that 1 over the object distance is equal to 0. And that's all that appears in the thin lens equation. So now uh, S prime, again, equals inverse of 1 over F minus 1 over S. That's inverse of 1 over F minus 0. So that just equals F. The image distance equals the focal length in the case when the object is out at infinity. You have parallel rays, and so the image forms right at the focal point of, of the lens. So S prime equals exactly one centimeter. That was the focal length we computed before. So the new position of the lens is one centimeter. The old position was 1.0714 centimeters. So we're now closer to the detector by the difference there, which is 0.0714 centimeters or 0.714 millimeters. Looking up at the uh, answers, that's closest to A. Okay, so the two concepts here from this question are one is the F number of a lens, which is just a historical way of talking about lenses. It's always the focal length divided by the diameter. It's a good thing to know. 
And the other is the thin lens equation. The thin lens equation relates three variables to each other. One is the distance of a lens to an object. The other is the distance of that lens to some well-focused image. And the third is the focal length of that lens. My name is Jason Harlow, and I approve this message.